Did you love that question I got? We got a fantastic question. This darling man, he's, had, he's getting a blow job from his wife, and she starts to just tickle his little buddy hole. Just tickle it. And there's a little art to it. And she knew what she was doing. Yes, she did. That's what I thought when I read the question. She knew. She's and so he, he tickling and got all relaxed, and oops, next thing he knows. She slipped. He said it. She slipped her finger in. And, and it felt, and it felt, it felt fabulous. And he had this incredible orgasm. And now he's confused about his sexual orientation. He thinks he may be gay. Well, aren't we all? <laughs> so I ask, what um, sex role, what, no, what, what gender is a finger? What gender? I love that. I love that. What gender is a finger if it feels good? If it's a man and, or a woman, And what gender is, is, is an anus? Now, we know a penis is a male gender, and the vagina is a female gender. But and the, the ass is androgynous. It could be either. Fingers, you know. tongues, and buttholes, totally androgynous. So bring it on. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy it, Dolly. Obviously, she had lube or something on her finger. A lubricant, and spit really doesn't and suffice you for you can't anal. have long fingernails like I do. You don't want Yeah, that. you don't want this. You have to buff that out. You don't want any sharp no, edges. No, You have to have a nice, smooth... And how do you play with a, a buddy hole, as you call it, when you first touch it? What, do you, what should you do? You tickle it. You just tickle around the sides and, you know, stroke it. I, I just say, stroke it. You know, like, don't, don't, definitely don't go in. No, no, no. You no, well, let it warm up. Yeah, hang out there for, and if you're, if you're paying attention, you can actually feel the muscle relaxing. And that's exciting. I love that moment. You're like, oh, I'm yeah. in. I'm in. <laughs> well, you, then you can go in. And you go in with the finger pad. Yeah, the meaty part of your finger pad, not with your finger tip. It hurts when you point. Poke. That's yeah, a poke. Yeah, it's a poke. You don't want to poke. No, no poking. <laughs> so, yeah, it's, and, and slow, and slow. Don't and where is it? What well, you it's find? just, you, it's just inside the anus. I mean, you know, it, it's like everything else, different, different positions for different. It feels like a walnut. You put your finger in and then pull towards you because it's on the other side. It's not on the back side of the anus. It's this way. And you curl your finger up. And I, one guy, the first guy I did it with, it's like it felt like a walnut. It was so easy. He had an easy prostate. Now, she had, yeah. I, I've never felt the walnut, so. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't go looking for a walnut because it may be a peanut. I mean, what, what if it's an almond? <laughs> people are literal. Some people have wanted to call it the pea spot, the prostate spot. And I, I don't want to turn it into better than the head of the dick. It's all good, but it's like clit stem with vaginal pen. When you combine yeah. them, yeah, exactly. it's a winner you're doing, every yeah, time. You're doing penal stimulation and anal stimulation at the same time. I always used to do it if a guy wouldn't come. You know, you're blowing him, and he won't come. And you're like, oh, God damn it. Uh, My jaw is killing me right for the prostate. They can't hold back. No, you know, they can't. It's a, it's a great... It's a, and by the way, masturbation and anal play... Do incorporate anal play into your masturbation. Think of the Aneros. It's very small. You insert it, and it has these toggles. And yes. You know, the movement's just pressure against the prostate. It's not in and out. No, 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 no. That simulates defecation. It's just pressure. It's a tickle. It. It's, it's, it's a tickle. A, yeah. Tickle, 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 tickle. Oh, that's good. That feels very good. We have got to let go of homophobia. Yes. You men are so uptight about about being gay. I mean, really, you should be so lucky. You'd be having a lot more sex than you're having right now. And spending a lot less time and money <laughs> on, getting, <laughs> on, it, on, on getting laid, whether it's your girlfriend or your wife or whatever. So, no, yeah, anal play and, and, and the enjoyment of it does not mean you're gay. No. But you could be. <laughs> you have to ruin it now. <laughs> We're going to have all of American men playing with their prostates, and now you had to ruin it. Sucker punch. But you may be. I mean, why not? It's true. <laughs>